Hey everybody, this is Lemonade's KRGN, and we're doing another toy review this week, or proper I can say. Uh, and this is from Kaiju number eight, half mask, and it's from the company El Coco. <laughs> I don't know that Spanish or main Spanish. I don't know, but it's a Japanese, you know, it's from Japan. And this is one of those, I think you can buy those at the store, or you can win those on those machines and the claw machines. All those, you know, those machines that you, you see like in Japan. Because they have really cool arcade, um, toy machines that you can just play and it's sometimes they're very hard sometimes they're kind of easy or sometimes they actually help you win it and usually that's where you got these or you buy these in the store um and i actually saw this i knew about this and i saw this online i thought damn this is cool and of course i tell you the price and how much i got at the end of the video but let's look at the box itself so you guys can get a better look at the design of the box it's a replica yeah it's made from like a plastic um, it's from the, it's from that new, well, it's not a new manga, but it just got made into an anime that I actually got to watch. I haven't never read the anime. It, it seemed interesting because it has kaiju in it. So far, I think I've seen episode five, or, and it's, to me, I like it. It's funny. It has a good action mode, you know, good art style, good action, comedy, and everything all mixed together. So, let's uh, open this baby up and get a better look inside. And pretty much it comes in these two pieces, one being the horn and the other one being the mask. I just want to show you guys. So let's open this bay up and get a better look inside. Alright guys, so this thing doesn't come with a stand. I'm using this weird thing that I had for a while. It used to be like a light bulb, but it broke. But I like the stand part because it's metal. But so now I think I'm kind of happy I kept that. But I'll put that in the side for now, just for a bit. Yeah, let's see if I can do it because I have still so much light stand. So this thing itself, um, it's very heavy. I'm actually pretty excited. This thing is heavy. This thing has a kind of, it's a very thick plastic. Uh, it's not hollow inside. It's very, very thick and very heavy. Um, you guys, let's get a closer look at the scope on this thing. It's really nice, but you can't really appreciate it because, you know, it has a really nice scope, but because it blends in with the color gray, you guys can't really see it. Um, but this thing is scoped really nice. I'm definitely going to weather it so it just can pop out more. But yeah, this thing's so cool. Um... The back is uh, has nothing in the back. It has a hole. So I'm thinking, like, if cosplayers ever do going to cosplay or something, they could actually use this, modify it a little to make it look because it has a hole right there, and you can still see it, like a you know recopy a scene when he's uh, half damaged. You can see he's actually human face. Because in the show, it makes it look like he's wearing a suit. It, you know, it's weird. It's interesting. It's like a mutation slash suit into it. But yeah, kind of like a guy for vibe a little, a little, not a lot. But yeah, the, you actually see the teeth in the back, and that's really cool. But yeah. Um, let me zoom back out so you guys... So... Uh, yeah, this thing, like, um, I can't compare it to anything else. Uh, I, I just, I do love stuff like this. You know, I used to have the Ichigo Hollow Mask. I don't have it no more. I kind of, like, bummed that got rid of it a little, but eh, it's okay. <laughs> But I'm happy I got this, you know, because I'm definitely going to have this display with my kaiju figures, you know, Godzilla figures, because anything kaiju related, even Ultraman kaiju stuff, I like. And I'm definitely going to have this baby display. I'm definitely going to weather him. You guys will see a finished version of that after this, I'm done doing this video. But, yeah, that's it, you know. Um, so let's talk about the good and the bad about this. So, 
I'll be honest, I have no negative about this. Well, I think the only thing is, I wish it came a little simple stand so it can be this way like this. Even if it's a little small stand you put in the bottom, that would be so cool. It'll be just a little bit extra bonus for it. Because you have it like this, but uh, it's not balanced, so it tips over unless you have it in the wall. Uh, but I wanted this bed just like this, so I'm going to modify that little stand somehow. I don't know, I'm going to have it like maybe have it like this, have like tape behind it, or uh, maybe make like a little bit of stone in the floor of this to make it look cool. I'm not sure about that. I'll figure that out later on. Uh, so let's talk about how much and where I got it. So I seen this retail for on um, third sell websites like eBay. I haven't seen it on other, I haven't seen animated websites. Uh, I stumbled this through this through eBay, so I haven't really done my homework. But on eBay, they are going about 40 to 50 to 60 bucks. I'm thinking these, I could be wrong, but I think these retail in Japan about under 20 or, or 25 or even 30. Um, just because of the weight. It's a lot of weight, so you know this thing is very sturdy. It falls, it will take a beating. Um, I actually got this retail, well, I got this, not retail price, but I got this for $29 and I think 6 or $8 shipping. So I think I paid altogether about $38. And I'll be honest, this thing is worth the price. Uh, like I said, I've I seen so far, I haven't read the manga. I read, I've seen the anime. I think I'm in the fifth episode. I haven't seen the sixth episode yet. But I so far really do like the anime. I like the art style. I like the story. I think it has dark, has darkness, it has dark parts. You know, it also has a lot of comedy humor. It has a lot of action. So I, I'm, I'm starting to really like this anime. Um... But yeah, this thing is really cool. I really do like this. Uh, so try to get it for a nice, decent price. Um, I understand why some people probably do sell it for 40 up Because just the weight on this, uh, the shipping on this will be very expensive just to ship over here in the U.S. Because it comes with really pretty, pretty much a big box. And just the weight on this is, it's 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 heavy. It has a weight to it. Trust me. Um, but yeah, so try to get it for a decent price or even 40 is not bad. I got lucky. I got my for like I said, like about 28 bucks, But another $8, $9 shipping. So to get about $37, 38 dollars, don't you know? Just I can't really think on my head exactly, but it's about $37, 38 dollars altogether. So that's not a bad deal. Um, so I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, this is Limitless Daily DNN. Like I always say, any way to help the channel, please leave a thumbs up, leave a comment, subscribe. Any way to help the channel. And I will say adios and bye. Keep on collecting.